And now I'm gonna drop. Whee! Yeah, let's drop normally, and now... Actually have some sort of a shortcut here. Hopefully, hopefully this uh, will actually... I think if I, uh, if I go down here... Uh, Successfully, I can actually go down with that, uh, you know, go, uh, I'll be able to go back uh, to Elena without using uh, a shard. Uh, is there something that I can pick up from here? Oh, there's something hidden here. Dark matter? That's a new item, viewers. What the? Uh, malignant matter. A rare malignant matter of unknown origin. It's heavier than it looks. Interesting. That's probably something, uh, some sort of an item that only uh, appears in uh, daytime or nighttime. Yeah, finally. This, uh, this chain uh, was the most annoying one. Well, it's not, it's not like uh, it was annoying to... Uh, to go to. Oh, I can actually go up here again. Alright, alright, that's cool. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can go, I can, I can go back easily. To uh, Elena from here, yeah. Alright, oh yes, that is uh, definitely a good-ass shortcut. Or so I thought. <laughs> now maybe I need to switch to the uh, to the Dawn Tower before I can go here. Yes, sir. All right. All right. Okay. Finally, I kind of find a some sort of a shortcut. Actually, I can go back uh, the, up there really fast. Holy. Holy. Alright, so, uh... Uh... If I want to go back, I still need to go uh, to the, uh, you know... still need to go to, uh, to the, uh, to the, uh... Bit, uh I need to start from the Dusk Tower. No, I'm good. No, I'm good. Uh, you have uh, a lot of. Uh... I finished translating that text you gave me, Aaron. I hope you actually uh, are in love with uh, with this kind of work, cause I have a shit ton. So, this is what you want me to translate. Yeah, I have a shit ton. How many exactly? It's not gonna tell me uh, what did I give her. A vow of Ios. Uh, does it have anything to do uh, with, you know, what, uh, you know, lovers do in bed? <laughs> Is that what you call a ritual? Oh. It says that a helix of light appears if their love is true. Uh, uh whoops. Didn't, nothing happened when we did that, right? I think something happened, I don't know. Probably. Probably something happened, I don't know. Don't ask me! Oh, what the? She went to immediately. Now she teleported immediately there. Uh, viewers, I'm thinking of actually uh, uh, giving her a. Uh, You've got some flesh going. Well, uh, a blue dress. This kind of him, so it's time to. Thirty-six hundred. I'm sure that I'm going to be able to create some new items because of the dark matter. Although I'm not seeing any. Was there something else you want? Select the materials you want to combine. You're able to make the following items. I can make a sage stone using okay. You can't you? You're able to make the following item. You're able to make the following item. Holy. 
This goes into me, uh, the uh, lumber metal goes into making a lot of stuff. Of course, Mercury you can probably make half of the stuff that you find in the game well, yeah, using Mercury. Mercury is a key ingredient in almost everything. She's a little bit annoying. Gotta be honest. Yeah, viewers, I'm gonna I'm gonna buy her the blue dress since uh, we haven't seen her uh, wear it for uh, for a really long time. That will cost you. I wonder if she's gonna, you know, not gonna react well uh, to it. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, we have a reading material that we should go. That we should go through. Go through. What the hell? Oh, uh, it's it's already nighttime. So I'm, yeah, usually uh, <laughs> this is where I find the birds, and usually I find birds here. But I guess it's uh, it's already uh, too late for that. So yeah. And usually uh, this is where the fireflies actually pop up. But I guess this is uh, this is the time where uh, no fireflies nor birds are gonna pop up here, huh? I don't know, I gotta be honest with you viewers, this area rem somewhat reminds me of uh, of the temple in, uh, in the Shadow of the Colossus uh, game, you know, where you where you offer uh, 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 the girl, what was her name, Yorda? I forgot her name forgot her name, is, that, is Yorda the name of uh, the chicken and Eco or the chicken uh, chat of the Colossus? I forgot. I forgot. Yeah, Shadow of the Colossus and Eco of yours uh, are one of my favorite games uh, that I've ever played. I really, really love these games. Absolutely adore them. Uh... What's up, Heron? You want to talk about something? I wonder how it's turned out today. I don't have much confidence in the taste. Can we eat? It's full of nutrition, though. You'd better eat it up, all right, Aaron? Is that gonna be a cutscene for that? No. You need to eat proper meals to keep your energy levels up, Aaron. The key to this dish is to bring all the ingredients to the boil together, which does take... What's up? Yeah, nothing new, really. Although the dialogue itself is a little bit rare. Yeah, let's give her uh, this. Is this for me? Thank you. Mm. I'm sure I've seen this somewhere before. Uh, yeah, and you haven't uh, been wearing it. I remember now. I used to wear something like this in the village, back when we first met. I'm pretty sure that I gifted uh, this to you before. Yeah, I. this is the first dress that I gifted to you. You were really wary of me back then. You hardly said a word. Do you remember? Hey, look, man. Sometimes uh, it's hard to talk to girls, alright? If you're a nerd, a virgin nerd, that is... Um. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh. Alright, going to, uh, to ruin your new dress. <laughs> who, who, who make these kind of sounds uh, while? While eating. Well, I guess Elena does. So it's time to open for business. If you've got any spare, what? he'll combine. <laughs> What's that? If you want to enhance. <laughs> What's this? Don't panic if you wait a while. Was there some? Dear me. If it, I, was there something? Yeah, nothing new. Nothing new. I'll just try and see if uh, 
she's gonna say something to you or not, but, uh... Yeah, she doesn't, she doesn't. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and uh, head back to uh, where we left off, I think. Is it dusk or dawn? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start with the, the, with the dusk tower. Hmm, yeah. We need to go up uh, there as fast as possible. Don't forget to bring some meat. I think I that. Uh... Thank God that uh, you know that uh, pulsating uh, meat is uh, actually some sort of a common drop. Oh, I'm not gonna try and get it from these guys now, the bigger ones. Well, since you're here... Ripping flesh? Yeah, I'm not gonna... Uh... I'm not gonna deal with that. It's not, it's not enough. It's not enough for me. Pulsating fresh. Thank you very much. I think if I go to the middle area over here. I think if I go here, I'll be able to access that shortcut. Yes, over here. Uh, can I access? I think I can access it from here. Okay, I don't need to switch uh, back to get up or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Good, yeah. This is the short because oh my goodness, this is such a really uh, this path will save me a lot of time, a lot of time being able to go here. Oh, well, I gotta give it to the game. Gotta give it to the game with their, uh, you know. Uh, so you cannot actually go up from here, huh? Oh, this guy uh, has some sort of whip. He has a sword whip, like uh, what you call it? What was the name of that character in? Uh... What's the name of that character in Soul Calibur? Ah, uh, Ivy, Ivy. <laughs> some sort of a uh, sword whip. Yeah, sword whips. Hopefully this works. Uh, I didn't. I didn't really need to do that. I could could have switched. Okay, okay, okay. I forgot. I, for, I forgot about the this ladder. I forgot about this ladder. So, oh, there's a shit ton of monsters. It's probably because of the the uh, the nighttime. Nighttime monsters. Mm. Yeah, what I wanted to do 
is to actually switch here. And actually backtrack. I think there's nothing inside that. Anything important. Uh, there's nothing here. Nothing of importance. What the hell? This guy has some sort of a chain? Damn. This guy has chains? They can do the same that, uh, that I do to them? <laughs> That's actually neat. That's actually cool. I hate these uh, enemies. This is actually really cool. Oh, you can uh, unlock some sort of a shortcut here. Ah, it was worth it. Not only for the dark matter. Going back here was worth it. Not only for the dark matter, but uh, for actually making a shortcut. And that, that guy went back to sleep. He was trying to track me down and said, fuck it. I'm gonna go back to sleep. I'm working uh, two jobs. I have three shifts. I better go to sleep. Uh, this one is closed. I wonder why. I don't think we have a uh, fully explored. Uh... Oh shit! Oh. Autonomous too? Chate stone. Ah. Ah, I get it now. And there's no way uh, for me to actually go there. Uh-huh. Okay, I get it, I get it. Oh, we will find Mercury here. So, uh... There's uh, no chain or... Or hooks that I can hook, uh... Hook, uh... You know, to hook my chain with and swing uh, to the other side in this area. But I can do that in the other area. All I need to do is just unlock a path there. Okay. Now by switching uh, back to the Dawn Tower, I'm just going here. Go here. All right. Now it's open. Nice suit. And the game agrees. Actually, um, this is uh, this is uh, not what I should have done. Well, it's gonna be easier for me to start from here, though. Nice to. I will be able to get here to open this. I'm not gonna face the boss right uh, now, though, viewers. I'm not gonna go face the boss right now. This is supposedly the last chain for the uh, uh, dusk uh, for the uh, dusk tower. Well, I'm not gonna go uh, go here right now. I'm gonna actually. I'm actually gonna try and uh, destroy the, the last chain and the other tower as well. I mean, from uh, the reading material that I found, it sounds like uh, they're kind of uh, related.
kind of related. This uh, this one takes me up there for some reason. This should be a closed room, right? I cannot open it. From there. I can't, uh, I can't open it. It seems to be locked from the other side. Yeah, yeah. So I probably need to go off to unlock it or something. Okay. Oh, I need to switch to the... Ah, oh, okay, okay, okay. So it's hidden. It's hidden, actually. Okay. That tells me that it's actually hidden. Uh, alright. Was it here? Found a sage stone over here? I already been here. Huh, okay. This is cool. It's a rare find, really. Yeah, a good find as well. Orb of opposites. What? It's it's a broken orb too. What the what the hell does it do? Unreadable grimy note. Another... Huh. A reading material titled Centrum. The Fulcrum. Five pages. The military elite grow more frustrated by their inability to enter the tower named Centrum. Uh, what manuscripts remain say that this tower uh, acted as a kind of fulcrum for all the others? The army are most keen to study this tower more fully, but I'm not so sure. After all, uh, our forefathers were unable to create the final master, even with the power of the chain. Now that the power of the chain has, uh, has waned and the army is making a do with technology that acts as replica, of the real chain what replica of the real chain uh will we really be any more successful in creating that final master are we simply doomed to repeat the mistakes uh, of the past interesting oh, i found some uh, mercury here there's a treasure chest over here containing uh, the infamous spirit silver finally Been uh, looking for this one for uh, way too long and managed to find it. What the hell is this? Cracked orb. The upset balance of light and dark makes this orb extremely unstable. Huh. Weird? That's a weird item. I don't want disc to uh, discard it. Spirit Silver gleams. Uh, Divinely. 50 points in chain damage? Holy. Rare metal glowing with a divine light. Touch it to feel the power within. Holy. Holy. You know what, viewers? Something tells me. Uh, let me let me show uh, let me show you something here. I want to go back to the uh, to the Dawn Tower. Oh, oh, I I really just noticed that. So yeah, actually going there, uh, I need to. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Actually going there, I need to uh, to uh, unlock the hidden.
I have to unlock the hidden. Uh, uh vortex. Like this. Now we'll have access to this area. The Shard of Divinity. Mm -hmm. The game definitely know that, yeah. Uh, you, uh, you probably need to prepare before uh, attacking, uh, going uh, to the final boss. Or, you know, the boss uh, for these towers. Alright! Destroyed uh, all of the chains in both towers. Right? Right? <laughs> right? Right? Yes, sir. Can I open this? I can. Okay. Okay. I I can. I'm not gonna go. Th I'm go I'm not gonna go there, viewers. I'm not even gonna bother checking uh, what's inside that place. But I just want to check if uh, like something to you know. I had the idea that maybe this this area is. Yes, I don't know. Is uh, it's still sealed for some reason? So what's left for us viewers? Really nothing other than uh... actually I didn't read uh, the reading material that I got. Right? It might be actually really important. Alchemist duty. No, it's not uh, that important. It's gonna teach me a uh, new material here. Alchemist duty is to fuse, fuse, fuse! And fuse again! I managed to sneak in here in the uh, midst of the general confusion, but now a huge hole has opened up in the floor. Uh, get the ratio of white and black droplet mixed up in, in its... Uh, and it has explosive results. I wonder what happens when you use uh, equal amounts. I hurt my leg in the blast, and I'm uh, none too mobile at the moment. An alchemist who doesn't mix all he can mix is as worthless as mercury. <laughs> now I need to find uh, some of those droplets. Wait a moment. Those black and white droplets could be fused uh, with detonation ore. What? Alright. I guess uh, this guy taught me some sort of a, uh, a new uh, uh, he t uh, taught me a new recipe. So, so viewers, so yeah, there's nothing left for us other than uh, to continue. On to the boss, but uh, I'm not gonna bother myself actually trying t to defeat the boss now. No. I will uh, try to go back. Give Elena the. Uh, oh shit, this guy's blocking the path. Yeah, I'll be going back. You know what? What a fool. Ah. Bitch! Drop down here. Ah, don't mind me. Don't mind me. Uh, I think I need to switch. Here. 
here. Yes, sir. And yeah. Uh, yeah, that's it, viewers. The only thing that we need to do is just uh, prepare ourselves for the... For the battle. I'm gonna be able to get two... Two master... Uh, Two Master Flesh at one go, which is interesting, viewers. It's gonna be interesting. Maybe? Hmm. Who knows? We'll see, we'll see. She's about to go to sleep. Better go check on the bird, uh, pick up uh, whatever it has. Oh. Give me your dinner. get uh, one from inside actually just to be sure what about this one hmm I'm gonna keep these to see what I can do Got some flesh going. Well, well, I'll buy that for this cat, so it's time to open for business. Yeah, let's try and repair uh Well then, that this will one. cost you uh twelve hundred. That'll cost you this year. Seems that went well. Alright. Was there something else you want to So what does it exactly do? Lights and dark join. Maybe you can use it as a some sort of a. You've got some flesh going, so it's time to open for business. Uh, materials. But I can create something with. So I mean. The materials you want to combine. No. Okay. You're able to make the following items. Oh, well, I can only make the spirit tunic. With that one. There are new recipes. Or there is a new recipe that I uh, that I've learned. What creation method do you wish to use? Uh, it's all about mixing uh, droplets and whatever. Okay. I can make these. Oh, this is uh, if I mix them both as well. But uh, what do I need orb of opposites for, though? Yeah, making these might be a pain in the ass. Well, I can actually, uh... I think I can, uh, get light shade, uh, light shade shards from, uh, From the smaller enemies. Was there something else? Fair? Nothing interesting, though, of yours. 
There is nothing interesting, so... Uh, might as well, uh, yeah. Store all of these. Uh, do you, uh, translate something for me? No? I thought there was, uh, some, something there that I can read. What a fool. I finished translating that book. Oh, uh, you have uh, more uh, homework. So, this is what you want me. We're almost there. Did you hear the story of the box of hope? Awful things happened when it was opened. The box of hope. Not Pandora's. Uh, Pandora's box. Pandora's box reminds me uh, of a weapon. Reminds me of a unique weapon in. Uh, in Devil May Cry 3, there was a... Was it in Devil May Cry 3 or 4? It's a, it is a weapon that I rarely use. It's it, it was unique. I think I think it was in 4, not in... Uh, not in 3. Pandora's... Uh, Pandora's uh, box. Was it in 4 or 3? I'm gonna assume it's gonna be in 3, because... In 4... I think in 4, most of the weapons in 4 were really usable and really good. Uh, I think it's in 4. There was a weapon in uh, in one of the Devil May Cry games that was uh, that was called Pandora's Box. It was really a really an extremely weird weapon. Uh, it makes you think of uh, I, don't, I I haven't seen anyone that actually make use of it. It's probably in the third game. <laughs> I'm not really 100% sure. Where I I played a shit ton of Devil May Cry 3, by the way, viewers. You know, trying to uh, you know, uh, trying to finish the game, mo uh, finish the game multiple times, trying to get S ranks, and every possible uh, difficulty. Uh, and uh, that uh, that actually took uh, took me a while, but I do not remember. Like uh, regardless if it's uh, if it was in uh, three or four. I don't remember myself actually using it a lot because I didn't like it. Uh, it, it has some attacks that's actually really powerful, but uh, it's not the best uh, thing that you can uh, use. But it was weird. It was weird nonetheless. You know, weird thing that uh, this game reminds me of... Uh, well, it is an action game. I was about to say that it's weird that this game remind, uh, reminded me of... Uh, of uh, an action game, but uh, I always forget that this game is an action game. But uh, but this game is uh, purely, you know, I enjoy this uh, game, you know, purely on the aspect of actually uh, maneuvering the uh, the towers themselves, and I'm probably I'm interested in actually how the game actually ends in terms of story. But for Devil May Cry, it's purely. It's really because of uh, its style and definitely the gameplay. Holy, yeah, it's uh, this game's gameplay is n is no match for uh, for Devil May Cry. Holy, it's not even close. Not in that uh, Pandora's uh, box. Why was there hope? Because humans weren't given the capacity to know everything. When you know everything. There is no need for hope. Huh. When you know everything, doesn't that grant you, you know, peace and an and easy life? I don't know. Oh, well, assuming that you can achieve uh, whatever you know. Us humans aren't like that, though. That's why there was hope at the bottom of the box. I think there will always be hope for humans, no matter how much we learn about life. Yeah, but... There's the thing. There's uh, knowing how to do things and or and having the ability to actually uh, do it. Because yeah, w technically we can actually uh, technically we can actually travel. You know, uh, have you know planetary uh, uh, you know planetary travel between uh, 
between uh, planets. This is something that we, we can do right now, but... Or, you know, in, in theory, but actual, in actual capabilities? I don't think so. And I think this is something that I actually said before. Most... I'm, uh, like, I'm fore foreseeing in the future that uh, a lot of, th of the things that uh, we have and we can do right now, like making, uh, you know, uh, you know, making uh, some sort of a material, especially the materials or the, uh, uh, the materials that rely on oil. Uh, I think there's going to be one point in the future where, you know, where uh, the oil is going to be scarce to the point where not everyone in the world will have access to it. Uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be impossible for us to actually make the things that we already know. We, yeah, we know that uh, how to make the material. They're gonna be based on oil, like as I said, a lot of medical, a lot of medical instruments, a lot of uh, uh, you know, uh, even uh, even tra uh, traveling, uh, you know, even using a car, the uh, an oil-based car, you know, that uh, relies on gas and not uh, electricity. Uh, we all know how to make these, or, or the humankind know how to how to make these cars. But I think I can see, I can foresee in the future that we will reach a point where we'll know how to do it, but we won't be able to do it at all because you know we we're lacking the materials. So this is uh, the point that I'm argu arguing here with uh, with you, Eleanor. So knowing everything uh, doesn't mean that we. Ac w Knowing everything doesn't mean that we can actually do them. So. So. Uh, uh, if I become something from the other world when I. You know. That's uh, food for thought, viewers. <laughs> Don't give me a reason to worry, will you? Oh, shit. I wonder how my mother's doing. Um, I give, gave her a reason to worry that, uh, you know, we're gonna run out of oil. Holy. Like, imagine that, viewers, like, uh, seriously, imagine that, uh, we're gonna, we're not gonna have, uh, oil, or, uh, be able to fuel our motors, like, imagine that, even, like, even, uh, as I said, even, uh, planetary, uh, travel between the stars, the, uh, or between the planets, between stars is gonna be, uh, impossible at, the uh, at the time being, but in, uh, but, uh, at the moment, between plants, uh, even even traveling by uh, by uh, by a plane, it's gonna be imp impossible if you don't have gas. Like there are no, uh, there are there there haven't been a single plane or aircraft that that managed to, uh, to travel long distances uh, without oil. There's absolutely no. Uh, Aircraft that I ever made that actually managed to fly long distances without uh, without uh, without gas. So yeah, what's up? That's uh, that's kind of weird. In the far uh, future, though, I don't know if it's gonna be in my lifetime. I'm already uh, I'm already old, so <laughs> you kids are gonna be worried about that. I'm gonna. I'm going to be, uh, you know, at the time of that happening, I'm going to be uh, worried about uh, who's going to change my diapers in the future. I'm going to be, I'm going to be 80s and I'm going to be, uh, you know, shouting at clouds on I can't control my, uh, <laughs> my bladder and uh, it's going to be hard for me to, uh, to control my bladder. Yeah. All right. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and continue with the game. Shut up. Have a nice day with your philosophical uh, views. <laughs> let's continue the game. But you know, this is something that the game itself brought, which is uh, really interesting. The point of uh, us, you know, knowing everything that. Uh, but uh, that will be will be okay if we actually know everything. We'll discover all the secrets of the world. But uh, no, 
Definitely, definitely not. You've got some flesh going spare? Uh, well, well, I'll buy that for this kind. What can I do for you? Farewell. A thousand? Alright. Uh, so, yeah. Let's go ahead and read the. Uh, a few reading materials here before we actually venture to the uh, to the boss centrum. Is that gonna be the last tower? Probably. Vessel Testament number eleven and twelve. My twin sister is the only family I have left, but uh, but the war tore me from her. And I don't know where she is now, but I know she's alive. I have faith. Uh, this is the reason I came here. I despise war. It took my parents' lives and uh, separated me from uh, my beloved sister. This is why I chose to be a vessel. I pray no one else will suffer and that my sister can live in peace, wherever she may be. And let me guess. The, uh, the twelfth uh, vessel is going to be our twin sister. <laughs> Oh, no, no. My twin brother? Or maybe, yeah. Maybe it is. <laughs> maybe it is. Uh, yeah, maybe a twin. It's uh, a boy and a girl. My twin brother is my last remaining family member, but the war t has tore us apart. I heard that he was uh, sent to the front, yet I believe he is still alive. I hate war. It has stolen my parents uh, from me, and my, bro and my brother is missing. If I can help remove some of the sadness and misery that war has brought, I am willing to sacrifice myself. Shit. This game wants to hit you with the feels, viewers. This game wants to hit you with the feels! <laughs> now it's being translated? Alright. Alright. Uh, healing materials? Yeah, I think uh, I'm thinking uh, we're fine. We're fine. Alright, viewers. Yeah. Let's head up and uh, try to beat uh, one or probably both of the bosses. I don't know if we're going to be able to do that. Alrighty. Yeah, time for us to head to the boss. I wonder if I should actually start to... Uh, if I should start with the... Uh, with the Dawn. With the Dawn uh, boss, because, uh, you know. Um, so boss. What the... I wonder why I should start with the uh, with the Don uh, boss before the other one. Ah, oh, this is not where I want to go. Actually, is this where I want to go? No, 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 no. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter uh, how much health uh, I'm gonna have uh, because uh, there's going to be a there's going to be a uh, bo both fountains are gonna be up there, so no need to bother myself. 